Many TFC fans have asked me, when will we see new TAM signing Erickson Gallardo feature in the team? The answer, not quite yet. In the build-up to the Montreal Impact game, Gallardo experienced a slight quad strain. TFC decided to play it safe with Gallardo as he did not play or feature in the Montreal Impact game. He went for a scan early last week and it revealed a grade one, just a very slight quad strain, which will keep Gallardo out of the team for 10 to 14 days. That means, no, he will not play this weekend against FC Cincinnati. The strain is really quite innocent, but it gets a little bit more complicated considering right now is really Gallardo's preseason. He last featured in a match, it was an international friendly, Venezuela against Ecuador back on June 1st, and didn't feature for his former side in Zamora since May 19th. So really, it's about building him back up to full fitness, and the quad strain provided a little bit of a setback. A realistic return date would be for the New York Red Bulls game in about a week and a half from now. In the meantime, Gallardo is acclimating to his new surroundings. I saw him today, he was in English class as he's learning, of course, a brand new language. And speaking to the coaching staff in what he showed in training before he suffered the setback, was a player that is much like Jacob Schaffelberg, loving to get in behind and showing real attacking intent. He's aggressive in his movement, but he's also very smart in the way that he plays. Greg Vanny told me that even when deployed in a more defensive role, he caught on to things quick, was solid defensively, good in positioning, which shows that the young player can be a complete project. So, Got to keep the long view in mind. He's still 22 years of age and with a possible return in about 10 days from now, things are looking up for Gallardo at Toronto FC. And really things are looking up health-wise across the entire squad. Chris Mavinga had this little ankle foot injury that kept him out last weekend. Drew Moore was still about a week away from being able to play 90 minutes of football. So with those two players back in contention for the weekend, things look really good at the back for TFC. As far as Josie Altador, he hadn't played 90 minutes for Toronto FC since May 31st before playing two games in the last week. He's going to be good to go after playing 45 last weekend as well. Marky Delgado dealt with some cramping issues ahead of the weekend's game. He looks to be good to go as well. So really for the first time all season, other than Gallardo this weekend, TFC should have a full selection of players to choose from. This has been your TFC Insider, presented by the all-new Kia Telluride, and I am Gareth Lewis.